Hey, this is Mike Koenigs, and this is the Traffic Geyser Advanced Video Player. This is a really cool feature that lets you put YouTube videos on your site without branding or advertising, and it includes integrated forms and redirects. And what's great about it is you'll never have to pay for video hosting again, but there's a whole lot more it does for you, and let me show you what it's capable of doing. First, let me show you the biggest problem that I have on a consistent basis, and that is, let's say you've got a YouTube video and someone watches it and they've been playing and here's one that's just finishing up and at the end of course if you have embedded your YouTube video on your site you're gonna get ads that may end up actually promoting someone else's products that's the last thing you want or they'll display something that you certainly don't want your users uh, seeing like for example I've got a short skirt thing here might be interesting to some of your viewers but not any women for example that are watching it so what if you had a video that would look like this let me show you an example okay now here's a player no branding as you can see and let's say if at the end of it it would display a little opt-in form like this and actually be able to subscribe people to an email right on any website or if after it finishes playing it would redirect to an affiliate link well that's exactly what we built into the new traffic geyser lead generator video player with special functions so a few more things you'll want to know about it number one I'm going to show you what the player is you kinda of have an idea on it how to set up a video how to actually go through the settings and then how to post the video on a website or a blog here's a couple things you'll need one is a link to a YouTube video you'd or you can upload an FLV video into your traffic geyser account we actually host videos now so you don't have to do it anymore this is in the platinum account and or you might want a link to redirect to or a lead page to direct your leads to that are built into traffic geyser and then of course a place to put your video once it's set up let's say for example I have a YouTube video and again you can either upload it or um, you can just use a YouTube video so I'm gonna copy that URL right now so I'll copy it and I'm gonna go into the custom video player and let me show you what that looks like it's actually under tools you choose what we call right now the beta video player when you see this it might be different we're still testing it out so you click on create new video player and here you can either select an FLV file or choose YouTube. All you have to do is paste in the URL you just got. Okay. Now what's cool is you can also check something called YouTube high quality playback. YouTube now supports what they call high definition playback and if your video has that here you can see if it shows a little link like this either watch in normal quality or if you've clicked on it it'll say watch in high quality okay you can uh, pick that option well you can uh, choose the dimensions of your video here depending on how it was uploaded into YouTube okay this particular one is 640 by 360 now even though in YouTube it's actually scrunched up here our heads are a little bit pinched you'll see in a moment that what we do is make it look really cool now you can choose whether or not your video is going to automatically play and you can uh, display a, a little logo in the bottom right hand corner of your video if you choose to do so and we've got to help every step of the way now here's where the thing gets really interesting we have different actions while the video plays you can choose to either show an opt-in form or display buttons on the screen so if you want people to maybe follow you on Twitter or something like that you can actually display buttons I won't show that in this demo but you can then do a redirect at the end of the video so you can jump to a specific web page show an opt-in form or show buttons I'm gonna choose show opt-in form in this particular demo and here's where you pick your options now you can choose right here to either associate with a lead page or just send an email notification when um, someone actually subscribes you can technically just paste in an autoresponder address right here if you wanted to um, in this particular instance I could associate with a lead page these are traffic geysers lead pages that we um, create automatically for example you're looking at one right now so um, this is where you've got a little builder that'll create the equivalent of squeeze pages with integrated videos 
Again, really cool. Well, inside our lead page generator, you can actually track all the leads, follow up automatically. You can even do direct mail with them. In this demo, I won't go through all the details, but it's a very, very powerful feature. Well, the lead page I'm going to associate with, though, is this one right here that I've created. Okay. And that just appears right here. I'll scroll down to it. It's called licensing. And I can choose whether or not I want to display different field names. In this one, I'll only display email. I could say first name as well. Okay, and over here, what's my form header? Well, this is just going to basically be a little bit of copy that's going to appear. And I actually pre-typed this so I don't have to bore you with the details. I'm going to just paste that in here. Get a free 30-minute video and learn how to make money with licensing with no experience product or list. Okay, the submit button, that's what they're going to see on the bottom of the screen. I'll just paste that in there. Um, I can choose the button color if I want blue or yellow. Turns out that yellow gets more conversions. And I'm going to have a little piece of text that appears after someone presses the Submit button. Check your email for a confirmation link. And I can choose whether or not I want to show a close box on the form. Well, the other thing that I can do is uh, if I were doing something with buttons, this would actually allow us to change what the buttons would look like. For the sake of this demonstration, I'm not going to go through that right now, but this just determines what kind of objects appear on the screen. I can adjust the controls. Here I'm going to say I want my text to be a little bit smaller and black. You'll see this in a moment. And then I can click on the preview link and actually see what this looks like. So here you can see a countdown and there is our button. Okay, pretty darn cool, or our, our opt-in form I should say. So I can go here and say Mike and um, my email at domain.com, whatever that happens to be. And when I click on that button it actually displays the copy. Pretty neat with some nice animation effects. Now if I actually go over to my lead page generator, again right now you're gonna see that this represents 980 views or and 196 opt-ins for this particular page. If I do a refresh and scroll down you'll see that I now have 197. Now because there are real people in here I won't display these but I can actually list all my leads I can export them as an Excel database, I can graph my views etc etc and this is all included in Traffic Geyser's cool lead page generator. But again I can go back, I can tweak this video player setting in any way that I want, change the colors, the positioning, what fields I capture or I can just give it a name. I'll call it my license. Okay, click on save player, and here is where you get the code. This code you can select and paste onto any blog or any website you want, and use it unlimited number of times, and have this fancy thing embedded on your screen, and you'll get the functionality that I showed you here. Now you can see I actually added this to my uh, original page. Now this is before I um, created the version we have which actually has the first name in it and what's great about this is even though the video is now posted on a blog I can always go back and tweak it and it will automatically update on any site. So um, that basically means that you can actually replace the video in the player remotely and not have to update the code on your site by just simply going under player options and maybe pasting in a different YouTube video or choosing the FLV and selecting it in your Traffic Geyser directory. So that is the super cool new custom video player. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm looking forward to seeing what you do with it.